Picture Athens way back, like we're talking ancient Greece, around 400 BCE. Socrates wasn't your typical Athenian, let me tell you. Nah, he was more like that quirky neighbor who's always asking questions and making you think. So, Socrates didn't write down his thoughts himself. No, he was all about chatting, questioning, and stirring up the old noggin. He'd stroll around the marketplace, engaging in debates with anyone who'd listen. People couldn't ignore him. He was like a magnet for curious minds. Now, what set Socrates apart wasn't just his love for chatting. It was his method. He'd ask questions that cut right to the heart of things. None of that surface-level chit-chat for him. He wanted to know what made folks tick, what they believed and why. Some folks loved him for it, but others, well, let's just say they weren't always thrilled about being put on the spot. But here's the kicker. Socrates wasn't just about ruffling feathers. Nah, actually, he genuinely believed that questioning everything was the path to wisdom. He famously said, the unexamined life is not worth living. Now chew on that for a sec. It's like he's saying, hey, don't just drift through life. Stop, think, and figure out what really matters to you. And let me tell you, that quote right there, it's like a spark. It ignites something inside you, makes you want to dig deeper, question more, and seek out the truth. That's the magic of Socrates. He wasn't just a guy with a big mouth. He was a thinker, a provocateur, and a true believer in the power of knowledge. So, if you're ever feeling a bit lost or unsure, remember old Socrates and his quest for wisdom. Who knows? Maybe his spirit of inquiry will guide you to some profound truths of your own. Hope you enjoyed the story of Socrates. If you want to delve deeper into ancient leaders' lives and teachings, there's a whole world of philosophy waiting for you in our channel to explore. Thank you for watching.